This storm looks like it has some potential for something that would be great to see. Right here is where you can start to see more of the storm itself. Right there is the base of something in the storm. As I zoom in, you can see what looks like to be a storm front. This is where it all starts to unfold. This storm has produced a supercell. Supercells are the least common thunderstorms that happen, but are responsible for the majority of the world's violent tornadoes. However, not all supercells produce tornadoes. Only 20% of supercells produce tornadoes, which is fairly low if you think about it. But that doesn't mean that supercells are dangerous though. They can produce strong damaging winds and hail. The rain shaft is back there. And this shot of the storm scales to this pick of another supercell. This is very similar because of the rain curtains being on the right side of the storm front. As it's getting dark, this time of the video will be brightened up to get a better look and view of the storm. This is a shelf cloud, usually formed at the front of the storm. These clouds come in all different shapes and sizes. As the name suggests they sometimes look like bookshelves marching across the sky. Some of them are very small and some of them look like waves going in reverse. These clouds can be associated with storm like the bow echo which, if lasts long enough and creates a 250 mile long damage path, then it's officially a derecho. Bow echoes are defined by their bow-like shape on radar.